baseball season is here, and the Minnesota Twins will return to Target Field Thursday for their home opener. Yeah, we have anything but baseball weather for the 10 game homestand. However, good timing. There's this new place for fans to warm up and watch the games. This is called Bat and Barrel. It's a new area on the club level in right field. Now, it's not been rebuilt, it's just redesigned. The team remodeled that Metropolitan Club, and they've changed it into this really cool looking dining and bar space for all fans. Anyone can go there now. They have two bars, a lot of TVs, as you can see. Also, they have a lot of cool twins memorabilia and history. So, Bat and Barrel is the new place, and along with that new hangout, the team also unveiled its new menu today. This is the part we like. Uh, some of the new <laughs> restaurants include Holy Land Deli, Crave, and Red Rabbit. And these, all these dishes we have in front of us, they're all sold at the Bat and Barrel area. Yeah, so here is the new uh, burger from Ike's, the Ike's Tavern Burger. And as you can imagine, just like stuff at Ike's, it's big and yes. plentiful. Yes, for sure. And the Hell's Kitchen Impossible Burger, it's actually like a veggie burger. There's no meat there. Yeah, that one's so that's, that's that one's one meatless. Right here, which looks um, very good. These are new. These are called uh, Hot Indian Frites, and uh, oh, just, they're good. Yeah. Are they? And they have a little okay. kick to them, which is nice. And then this is Red Cow's Tennessee Hot Chicken, which is fabulous, right? I mean, I haven't had to try because I took there a used chunk to be four pieces here, but now there are only three. Well, I didn't want to eat with my mouth full and wasn't able to and explain. And just like that. But Here's, that red cow Tennessee chicken's really good. It looks really good. Yeah. At, uh, is it like a buffalo wing sauce or no, something? It's no, it's more of a has more of a spice than a buffalo. Okay. And here are the crave sliders. And once again, Frank couldn't wait, so he took a bite out of that too. These crave sliders are always great. Well, you could say I couldn't wait, or you could say that was a good idea <laughs> to try it ahead of time. <laughs> One of the two. All right. Well, I'm going to try some of those in a little bit. But okay. the team also showed off some of its upcoming promotions today. There are several T-shirt and hat giveaways throughout the season. Even a few bobbleheads. Uh, the twins are also selling. Special Prince themed shirts in the team store. That's fun. And you can check out the full list at WCCO.com slash links. 